Hi guys, welcome, Miss Rupa here. Um, a space study would not be a space study without the topics that we're gonna cover this week. And that is the topic of astronauts and then the topic of rockets, two very important things when we're covering space. So the first lesson that we're gonna talk about is the topic of astronauts. Now, let's start with what is an astronaut? Who is an astronaut? So an astronaut is a person who is specially trained to travel into outer space specially trained. So it could really be anybody, but there's a lot of training that is involved in order to become an astronaut. So astronauts aboard a spacecraft have many, many different responsibilities. Um, typically there is a commander of the ship and he's kind of like the boss, he's, he's the pilot of the, of the spacecraft. Um, and then some other positions that are also extremely important would be like the flight commander, um, the payload commander, engineers, mission control specialists, and science pilots. All those people work together on a spacecraft to make things just flow easy, okay? Um, it is not as easy as you would think to become an astronaut, although it is very, very doable, okay? They have to undergo extensive training to become an astronaut. Um, in order to do that, they have to be able to handle the physical rigors from the high gravity of the launch itself. So the training starts not just while they're up, uh, up in space, but when they're on the ground getting ready to go to space. So that launch from Earth, from the ground to space, you have to be ready for it. And it's very rigorous, okay? So they have to be ready for the launch and also they have to be ready for when they're in space because there is no gravity. So they have to be ready for that weightless feeling that they're going to get when they're in space. Um, a lot of the time also they have to be prepared for the high temperatures that space brings because what is nearby Earth? What gives us our heat and warmth? The sun. And the sun has a lot of heat and also a lot of radiation. So in order to become an astronaut, you have to be able to withstand that heat and also be careful and be safe from that radiation from our star, the sun, okay? Um, when an astronaut is in space, they also have to practice being um, weightless, but also being sort of tethered to a spacecraft. Um, there are really two ways that that can be handled. So they'll practice being tethered to the spacecraft while they're maybe working or fixing something on the outside. But also the spacesuit itself has rockets. And so they have to be able to practice using those rockets and kind of maneuvering around the spacesuit, um, the spacecraft. So spacesuits are another thing that astronauts have to practice wearing and they have to kind of just get used to because that, that spacesuit provides them with the air and protection that they need for all those things that we previously mentioned the launch sequence, the weightless feeling, and the sun. That spacesuit is something extremely important, okay? Um, I wanted to talk a little bit about a certain type, a certain mission that involved two very important astronauts. All astronauts that have ever gone to space are super important and they've gone there for very important reasons. But one mission in particular that stands out is called the Apollo 11 mission, which was the first manned mission to our moon. Um, there were three astronauts that were involved too. Um, Buzz Aldrin is one of the names that we're gonna talk about. Neil Armstrong is the other name that we're gonna talk about. So Buzz Aldrin was actually um, the second person to kind of step off the, off the ship onto the moon, but he was the pilot of the lunar module, the Apollo 11. So he was the pilot of that ship. So still a very, very important name to remember. Um, the other name that I mentioned was Neil Armstrong, and Neil Armstrong was the very first person to step off the Apollo 11, step right onto the moon, and he said that famous phrase, um, that's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Um, probably a phrase that you've heard in movies and just researching space. You are gonna hear the name Neil Armstrong and you're gonna hear that saying a lot. So take a minute while we're talking about space to really research the Apollo 11 mission. And also guys, research the other astronauts that are out there, like Mae Jemison, scientist that was very, very important in space research, okay? Um, so Buzz Aldrin, Neil Armstrong, and then there's so many more that can be learned, okay? Um, so astronauts, we talked about why they're important. We talked about the rigorous physical strains that they have to go through in order to get to space from the very first, the very beginning, that launch sequence 
up to when they're in space, the spacesuits, why they're important, and how, how long it takes for them to be able to wear those and be able to feel comfortable in those. So being an astronaut is challenging, but very, very worth it and also very doable, okay? So I hope you will join us for our second video later on this week on the topic on that one is going to be rockets. So I will see you guys on the next video.